Well, the Los Rios Community College District is increasing police presence at American River College in Sacramento. District leaders say it's all about maintaining safety on campus after they say racist and threatening messages were directed at the college president. ABC 10's race and culture reporter Candace Red shows us the changes are getting noticed. We want to be safe when we come to work. The Los Rios Community College District is working to ensure safety at American River College in Sacramento. We want to know about known threats and we want to know it in such a way that we can take immediate action to protect ourselves and our students and our communities. The district is partnering with the Black Faculty and Staff Association on improving safety, transparency, and leadership commitment. The association sent the district a list of demands in response to a racist incident targeting the college president, Melanie Dixon, last month. It's really our goal to not only improve the conditions and opportunities for all Black employees, but also for our Black students. The district says a former student, Jamie Barnes, left more than 300 racist and threatening voice messages towards Dixon and other staff members. Los Rios police arrested Barnes last week for the second time for violating a temporary restraining order. Police also sent an email alert to students and staff with Barnes' photo attached, stating she was released from jail Wednesday night. We are concerned both with the transparency with which incidents like this are reported and how they are followed up. This student's name and photo should have been circulated a long time ago. You know, now the district is responsive, and this is great. This is how it should be, how it must stay. Police say there's no evidence that Barnes returned to campus. The district plans on pursuing a permanent restraining order at a hearing scheduled later this month. And Los Rios released a statement in part reading regarding the set of demands shared by the Black Faculty and Staff Association. We are sincerely grateful to that group of committed educators for their work to make Los Rios a better place for our Black employees and students.